What's up everyone, it's Kyle from Color Expression, back with another swatch and review. So today we're checking out the latest release from Sir Colors, which is their collaboration with singer, songwriter, influencer, MXM Tune, or Mom Tune, however you like to say it. They collaborated on six new shades, including some jellies, shimmers, a really cool flaky polish, so I am very excited to look at these in a little bit more detail with you guys. These are all available now from Sir Color, so I will link their website down below. You can also use my single-use affiliate code with them, Color10, and save 10% off your order, so make sure you grab all your favorites and get a little discount. Also, thank you so much to everyone who has used that code already. I seriously appreciate it. You guys are literally the best. Thank you so much for your support. A few facts about Sir Colors, they are an independent nail polish brand that is based out of Brooklyn, New York. Their formulas are 10 free, non-toxic, vegan, and cruelty free, and I will also link their international stockist page down below as well. If you love nail polish, make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below and turn on notifications so you're always staying up to date on the latest releases and Sir Colors content, and while you're going to be down there, you should give this video a thumbs up. Alright, let's get on to these swatches. We've also got some super cute packaging for this release, so we will look at each box with each shade. First up is Go Away. This one is a yellow jelly polish, which is not something we see too often, I feel. So I really liked this one. I feel like it was a fun addition into this collection and just into my collection in general as well. You can see on this application, we are getting that Cirque Jelly formula, so it's gonna be a little bit transparent. You're gonna have that nail line peeking through even after two to three coats, but that is the point of a jelly polish. And I really liked how this one looked in the end. And another thing you might notice is that wide brush in here, which it's official. We are always getting this wide brush in every circ release now. I totally love this thing. It is amazing. You can see in the video throughout this whole thing how easy and Honestly, minimal cleanup was required for this application, for these manicures, for these live swatches. It was just such a great experience. I totally love that wide brush. And here you can see that manicure all done. We're getting some really nice jelly nails. I love this look. I feel like it's great for summer. It's great for these warmer months and totally a great shade. Next up is Fuyu Jelly, and of course, just from the name, you can tell we are getting another jelly shade, but this one is this really nice, bright, almost like it practically looked neon. It's like not neon at all, but it almost gave this sort of neon feel in the bottle, and then in that finished manicure, it's just a really vibrant orange shade it's super beautiful you can see on that first coat it was very transparent and then we're going to build it up in three coats for this video you'll see that that just gave really nice color payoff still gave that little bit of transparency but i really liked that look in the end so again great formula we're getting that same wide brush i could say it all day every day i love this wide brush it was totally a needed change from the skinny brush that they used to use so i am just i'm so happy we're getting that now in all of these polishes but again you can see in this full hand especially how just bright and vibrant this color is like for a jelly it's just so pigmented it's so cool and definitely a good one for summer again up next we have Introvert and this one is a green base shade and then in there we are getting a bunch of shimmer, a bunch of hollow glitter. I totally love this sort of formula from Cirque. They do it so well and also of the whole collection this one I built up in two coats and felt like that looked really good so I actually stopped there but every other shade was three so I mean not a big deal but just something I thought I would mention. But you can see the shimmer in here head on from this angle we're getting a really nice sort of vibrant pink color but then that's going to shift through to an orange to a yellow and then a green at the most extreme angle so we're getting a super shifty pigment in this shade i love these sort of shimmers that are almost glittery and then with that hollow glitter as well it's just oh such a good combo. These are my favorite type of shades from Cirque. They could do any color, any any type of thing like this, I'm gonna totally love. So I'm such a fan in there. You can start to see that color shift. Oh, it is so nice. 
Next we've got Crying Contest, and again we have a shimmer shade here with a little bit of a different shimmer pigment, so I'd say this one is a little bit finer, not quite pearly, but almost like a mix between a shimmer and a pearl, and it didn't have a super duochrome effect, but honestly, with this sort of base color, I really just like the almost golden shimmer that we get in this shade, so I don't think any sort of color shift was necessary. I feel like the pairing of colors here already is so gorgeous, and then of course, that scattered hollow glitter, I, I could also be obsessed with that all day long. I love the cert glitter. I feel like in the right light and especially outside in the sun, that just looks so good. It's so sparkly and then paired with the shimmers, paired with a little bit of a darker base, you get that pop of the glitter. So totally obsessed with this shade. This is again, one of those ones that Cirque always nails it no matter what color combo no matter sort of how they formulate this type of shade it's always a winner in my book so definitely happy to add this one to my collection oh look at that look at it in the light it just looks so good up next we have porcelain plum and this is another shimmer shade similar to the last one where we're getting that sort of really fine shimmer pigment it's almost pearly but not quite but it's still just oh it's such a gorgeous effect especially i always love a purple polish so we have that purple base we have that shimmer that's sort of pinky sort of golden it's like a really beautiful mix of color and i feel like it's almost hard to tell because the base is tinted so you just get this really nice shimmery sparkle coming through that purple base and then we of course have all of that scattered hollow glitter in there too so i built this one up in three coats realistically maybe could get away with two with this shade depending on your nail length depending on the application but for this video i did do three and i felt like that just looked so good it built up so nicely we got so much of that glitter so much of that shimmer it was oh such a gorgeous effect i feel like on stage under those nice bright stage lights a lot of these hollow glitters are gonna look so good rounding out this collection we have glitter glue and this one is a pink jelly base it's like barely tinted but you can see clearly it is a pink base but then in there we have so many iridescent flakies they're a bunch of different colors a bunch of different sizes you can see as we're starting to apply this shade we honestly have a lot coming off the brush and actually staying on the nail I did still choose to build this shade up in three coats, but you get so many of those flakies just in this really easy application. I feel like maybe it has to do with that wide brush. It just lets them all sort of rest and then stay on the nail. I don't know. Either way, super satisfying. It looked super cool in the end. I totally love the mix of color. I feel like you easily could do one iridescent flake and this polish would look really cool, but having that sort of mix of color, you just get that really nice effect. You get that depth. You can see sort of that pink hue from the base around the edges where you're not getting that really bright iridescence. So I feel like just in the end, this one looked so cool. I love the glowiness. I love that. I just love iridescent polish. I feel like this one matte would look super cool too. And looking at this full collection, you can see that range of color we got, the range of finishes. I love the hollow glitter and the shimmers, but then we have the iridescent and the jellies. And I feel like you could do some really fun nail art looks. You could pair these together in different ways, do like a Skittle, use the iridescent as a topper. There's just a lot of different combos and fun things to try. So in the end, I feel like this is just a really nice release. Now that we have seen these new shades, I want to hear your thoughts on them, so leave a comment down below. Let me know which one is your favorite, which ones are you going to pick up, are you a fan of MXM Tunes music? Personally, I love a good collaboration, but something about this one especially, I feel like the way that all of the shades and the collection in general feels like such a Cirque collection, but it's a collaboration and the collaborator had such a hand in making all these shades, but stay true to the brand and kind of showcase some of the best formulas they have to offer. I just feel like this was a really cool opportunity for a crossover and I really like the result. I feel like the packaging was also super cute. So overall, I really liked this release. I feel like you have some fun music to play while you paint your nails with these and be like, oh my God, it's like the same person. But I don't know. I just feel like this release in general, super cool. And I loved it. 
Like I mentioned earlier, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and send this video to all of your polish loving friends. Check the description as well for the links to products in today's video for some other discount codes, affiliate links, all that good stuff. But I think that's going to be it for this one today. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Their collaboration with Singer Sunger... Singer Songer. <laughs> Their collaboration with Singer Songer... Oh my god, I literally just did it again. Songwriter. Singer Songwriter. Singer Songwriter. She's a songwriter. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Songwriter.